Okay, I'm back. So we're going to replace this water softener. Very old. Going to replace this old. I think it's a uh, charcoal filter. But we're going to replace it. Old, old basement. Really old house. Beautiful house upstairs, but uh, basement's a little rough. We're also going to replace that old pressure tank from the well and the T and all the fittings down through there won't be the prettiest job because uh, the basement we're in but you'll notice it'll be a lot better so again as soon as Lee finishes his job we will install that so I'll be back with you so I just want to show you guys Hold on a second. Some of the nice work that happens around here. This is a uh, UV light that was installed by others. This is my first time on this job. This is not my job. That's how it was installed. Hey, I like that. There's the hanger that's holding the whole thing up. A DWV hanger. That stands for Drain Waste Vent. I don't think this is a drain or a waste or a vent pipe. So that's a real nice job. I got another nice part of this job I want to show you, but my battery's charged, and when it's charged, I'm going to take you over to the electric panel. Show you that nice job he just had done by somebody. I don't even know who it was. So this is a nice job here, huh? Jeez. We wonder why there should be inspections and people shouldn't uh, be allowed to do this stuff. That's just great. All right, I'll be back. All right, we're back. New tank. Took out all that old junky looking spider webby capper. Cleaned it all up. Put in a new uh, Challenger water softener. These are the best water softener heads on the market. And do a video to run through those out. Run how? Uh, run through those if anybody wants to know how. Uh, Brian tank. All I got left to do is to plug it in. I got to get some zip ties, and I'm going to talk to the customer about uh, redoing the rest of this copper, fixing everything up. Wasn't in his budget on this price, but we're going to come up with a number to redo all this. Get that UV light that somebody put in and, and straighten that out. Just do a nicer job. So it all looks like that. So let me walk you over to the uh, panel, this electrical panel, and show you what's going on over there. All right. So here we are at the electrical panel. It's dark, I don't know if you can see it, but it was labeled right here, well pump. And it was on two separate breakers, a 20 amp and a 20 amp. I shut those two off, which is wrong anyways. It should be on its own double pole breaker, not two single poles. And shut them off and it shut the computers off upstairs. So now we figure out they're down here on two separate breakers. There's a separate one and a separate one. So we gotta fix that. Alright, so long for now. Alright, that's better. That's it redone. Take you back over to the panel now that I figured out how to brighten it up. There's a better picture. So, brand new panel somebody had put in for this guy last year. Look at this mess. Unbelievable. Uh, guy rewired the pump with two 20 amp breakers. Two single 20 amp breakers. It's a 240 volt 20 amp pump. So this should be one breaker. Unless I'm wrong. I mean, I'm plumbing and mainly, mainly, mainly heating HVAC and do some plumbing. But to me, that's wrong and it's labeled wrong boom down here is actually where the pump was also it was two separate breakers can you believe this brand new electrician last year put it on brand new service for this guy 200 amp and just I don't know how it passed inspection it's terrible terrible job so just wanted to point that out that's awful hope the guy that put it in 
sees my video so I can tell him he did a terrible job. Thanks. Bye.